Welcome back to Factorio, folks. We are joined, as always, by ST Hedgehog, who has been busy in between episodes. I, I have. I have. I've done I've done a lot of waiting around. Yeah. Um, and building things. And, uh, and, and yeah, because we have, we have a lake full, don't we? We, we have a lake filled. So yeah, this was that entirely was entirely filled. Fun. So that's been done. Um, that's what a uh, uh, a good a good morning and a bit after work as well of just uh, yeah, uh, filling. <laughs> so, yeah, nice and easy stuff. Yeah, <laughs> it's a lot uh, of. Also, I built some things and changed some things. Okay, and, uh, let's see it. Uh, uh, right. Well, first and foremost, uh, we're we making grenades by our nuclear. I have changed the railway layout. Um, uh, the grenades. Where? Where is that? Where? 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 Where are we making grenades? Oh, there. Uh, by the by the nuclear. Yeah, there. So, yeah, I have changed this, and I think I got this slightly wrong. Did I get it wrong? No, not wrong. No, I didn't get it wrong. No, it's okay. Um. So the it's just it's no longer um, uh, the rail no longer pokes out, so that when we expand the nuclear, we can just expand it up a bit further and have more space. Mm -hmm. That was something like I said I was going to do a while ago. Uh, but the big thing is the rocket fuel production. Up okay. Where I'm yeah. I've redesigned it. Uh, I was talking to Pete a lot in the comments of the uh, last few videos, um, and. Uh, the system that I built before wasn't going to work because one train, there was no way it was going to keep up with delivering the light fuel. Okay. So now we have four segments, mm -hmm. which comes along, drops fuel, uh, light, fuel light oil into uh, these four tanks, and each tank individually goes up and supplies uh, two lots of uh, chemical plants and assemblers. One, two, three, four, five, six times. Uh, four times, sorry. Okay. One, two, three, four times, yeah. Uh, so, hopefully that'll that'll work. Mm -hmm. That'll that'll do its thing. So um, yeah, uh, the only thing I'm a little concerned about is um, the trains are going to unload, but because the way it unloads onto belts, the end one here is going to probably end up with still fuel in it because or light oil in it because. Just the, the uh, assemblage can't unload onto the belt because the belt will be full. Okay. So that might cause a problem. But I've got the station set to uh, um, uh, only enable if the first one, which should be the quickest one to empty, is below 10k. So hopefully mm -hmm. it will balance. I hope. I don't know. Does mean we need more trains for making light oil. Which does mean we need more light oil because we don't have enough light oil. Okay. Um, really being made. So, so yeah. Cool, cool. And this can just be copied and mirrored over should we need to have more because right now it's not technically making enough for what we need, but um, I need to put speed boosts and stuff in it as well. Okay. Uh, c couldn't you um, hook the pipes together in between the uh, refineries or, or what, what they are? Chemical plants and the assembling machines so that the oil would spread evenly? I, I could do. Uh, I suppose I could connect them all up evenly and then it would spread. But I, I kind of want to see what it does this way at the moment. Mm -hmm. Because the more spread you have, obviously, uh, the way fluids work is they try to level out all the pipes they're connected to. Yep. So the least you can have them connected to, the better. Really? Okay. Um, so I was trying it this way. If that doesn't work, I might try something else, but I don't know what... Um, Okay. We'll see how it goes, but it can be expanded and changed up, and mm. but we'll have to see how it goes. Let's plug it in and find out what happens. It has been making some rocket fuel because I I was building it, and as I was building it, a train turned up. I was like, oh, hang on a minute, why are you here? No. Oh yeah, because I because I plugged it all in. So. Uh, we'll so now it's plugged in. in. The light oil train should uh, should go. Is the light oil train moved? Where is it? Yes, the light oil train has moved. It's on its way. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Uh, but do we have any... We we don't really have many... Um, I know we've got 1.5k of uh, speed module 3s, which I need to put in all of these. 
I need I need speedrun module threes in every one of these uh, machines mm -hmm. uh, in order to make enough. Do we needs. really have that many uh, speed module threes? Cool. Yeah, one point five k of them. So I'm not yeah. going absolutely. Nice. My build works. Aha. Pete. Aha. 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 Okay. So <laughs> now <laughs> it's only a. a, a it's not something we desperately need anyway, is it? But no. But yeah, there we go. So that's that's going to run. That's going to do its thing. And produce the fuel of rockets. There we go. And it's already backing up because we're not actually using any rocket fuel. Because if you go down to where our uh, uh, train filling up eating is, where, where is um, that? Oh, there. Uh, yeah, we're all running on nuclear fuel. Oh, nice. Where is the new train filling up your thing? It is there. Ping. Mm. Uh, why didn't I go to it? Uh, you can just click that green text that says train stop that's now gone. But... Yeah, but then it just uh, shows me that we have three train's doing it oh that's because hold on there we go because if you click anywhere near a station for some bizarre reason it it, it, it decides to just show you yeah it decides to link to the station for some bizarre reason i don't okay. know so we're doing nuclear fuel now Ooh. yes <clears throat> all our trains are running on nuclear fuel fantastic um, and yeah, uh, but we were going to look at moving the smeltery. Yeah, that's the plan. That's the plan. And we were talking about, should, should we do it vertical or horizontal? No, I'm not sure. I mean, we have the two um, oil patches in there that we're using. So how how do we fit it in? Um, I mean, I'm 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 really not quite sure. Uh, so we, we we don't care about the two copper patches, the twenty one million, the eleven million, or the fifteen million coal patch, right? No, 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 not at all. They are because we have kind of some bigger ones around just yeah, they are they tad are not bigger. very important at all no right so if i copy that um right. didn't i make a blueprint of this i'm sure i made a blueprint of this i did make a blueprint of this. no while no, you design that i will go pick up some furnaces Uh, if I can find... We were thinking about doing it sideways as well, wasn't we? Yeah. Doing it vertically. Ha. Ha. Uh, Spidertron, come here. Right, so I'm on my way over to pick up a lot of electric furnaces. And I think I'll go pick up a lot of belts as well. And I guess we, we, we should extend it really so that uh, we we utilize the full uh, length of the belts, right? Uh, yes, yeah, that would be blue belts. Switch to the blue belts and... Uh... Yeah. Which is doable. In the blueprint, in the shared blueprint books, there is a uh, a smelting segment, which is one whole, like, segment with a drop-off station and a pick-up station. Okay. So we can just place them down and just keep, with that. and that, that is just repeatable. That, that entirely works for as many times as we need to. Okay. I just want to put down there. some radar stations at here, because I can't see. And then I'm gonna go pick up some belts. All 
All right, so I have a what the hell? entire. Who put these tracks in? Um, <laughs> probably me. Did I do There's something wrong? There's like a, uh, uh, signals like so many signals. Okay. Oh. I like signals. They tell me what I, to do. I, 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 yeah. I, I know what you've done. You've uh, just copy and pasted and, and it's copied signals. Yeah. Uh, but not only that, you didn't actually put the signals down. Oh. So while I'm walking along, actually putting all the signals down. Well, that's a bit lazy. that there weird okay right. we are running back i don't know if i'm taking the right signals out or not but yeah, that'll do. There we go. okay you're doing all that outside your spider tron that is brave yes because spider tron is too fast for putting down signals ah for putting down anything spider tron is far too quick so mm. as much as I love Spidertron, sometimes he has problems. Yeah. That's true. That's Maybe true. More wall. When we move all these furnaces, we're going to have to go biter clearing up north. Yes. Pain. There's also a very nice uh, oil field up there. We haven't even hooked up to the 7,399 oil field yet. There's a few, yeah, there's a few dotted around. Mm. But yeah. Man, we are going to need to clear a lot of trees here. We're going to need some, uh, some, uh, some chests. <laughs> um, I don't have much flame if you all left and they're too spread out really for flames, aren't they? Uh, okay. Yeah. I, I don't have I have five flamer through left so let me uh, convince some of the things to burn right now but you'll burn the tracks too that's true that is true but sacrifices must be made yeah that's true so let's go down here and just burn everything all right let's try it I'll use some of my flamer fuel as well uh, let's move Spidertron out of harm's way. And then I just I just personally go and set fast and tracks, that's fine. Mm. That'd be okay. I think we that actually need to move down right. south. The wind is Coming from the south, it looks like. So let's jump out here. Uh, 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 uh. Over there, train. Okay, um, so one flame of through left. Trees are burning. Turn on my robots again to get them to actually go and repair stuff. Um, oops. That, that's all of my flame of fuel gone. A 
blow up some cliffs as well while we're here. Oh, not the cliffs. No, plural cliffs. Yeah. Now, unfortunately, it leads behind dead trees. Hmm. But uh, at least it's less, less trees to kill. Yeah, that's true. Cliffs are a pain in the butt. Sorry, Cliff. Yeah, so, so are we going to... Is there, put it in vertically? Hmm. Yeah, I think so, because that I think that gives us more space, right? Uh, well, uh, I'm going to turn off my robot so they don't actually build anything. Uh... At least, not all cliffs are a pain in the butt, but cliffs, Cliff from Cheers, he was a pain in the butt. If you remember we need that TV show. Well, don't we? Yeah, we do. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. We need parking. It depends on how much parking we want. So we're going to just basically put it in the middle and then. Uh, I don't know. You're the architect. Way to just pass on responsibility. These cliffs there. It's not. There's no. Then no. 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 Surely not. There's a cliff up here somewhere. Where are you, Cliff? It should be right here. Oh. I guess we'll do it up. One, two, three. <laughs> um. If we didn't have parking, uh, literally, you could put two two of these smoking segments in. Um, uh, uh, I, will, I will put them down, and uh, you'll see um, okay. what I mean. Uh, I've turned my robots off, so I'm not going to build it. But if we put one there, and then put another one there, does it actually put it underneath the, 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 the dark stuff? But the um, the the train lines just link up perfectly. Uh, okay, so where do we put the parking then on the outside? I I I I know, but it it's just I'm just amazed that that actually works. Uh, that that just purely by coincidence, we've made this exactly the right size for two of these to fit in. Well, that's perfect. And we had not planned that. Not in any way, shape, or form. No. Uh, we're missing a radar. Can't see it without a radar on the left side. Uh, I've got the uh, radars in as many as we can, but uh, let's undo that. Uh, uh, come on. Come on, Forest Fire. Come on. You can do it. I believe in you. Oh, there are a may lot of just, trees left behind. May have to just empty my inventory and just. Uh... Do it that way. Because, yeah, this this might be a way to do it. So. Uh... Spider-Tron. Spider-Tron. Uh, uh, oh, Spider-Tron's really full of stuff. Jeez. Yeah, so is mine. But no, E, that one. Uh, put down a couple of chests. Uh... I have 31 squares in my spider drone filled up with uh, electric furnaces. 50 in each. Uh, I've My spider drone is mostly full of blue belt. So okay. that's going to work pretty well. Okay, so if I go to deconstruction planner and then I pick my remove trees. I have a, a thing spe specifically designed for removing trees. Come all the way down to here. And that was my last that cliff explosive. But unfortunately, I don't think that actually flags up stuff that's outside of my radar. So, it'd be nice if it did. 
Holy smokes, that's a lot of trees. Yep. No, don't stop here. Uh, let's go down here. And I'll start picking up some trees as well. This is where we need a, a, a spider trap. Why is there an oil train coming down here? What? Oh yeah, because it's okay. Oh yeah. That's why there's an oil train coming down here. Um, see, can I make some storage chests? Let's try and make some of those. Oh, I can't put them in there. It's gonna work. It doesn't seem like it. Nope, because uh, the chests and things are controlled by robot horse, not your personal. Uh -huh. Although you need logistic robots, don't you? Not construction robots. Yeah, that's true. But I have logistics robots on me. I have actually have fifty. Oh, okay. Then I guess it's just controlled by um uh rubber ports. Yeah, I guess so. That kinda sucks. Oh my god. Way too many trees to collect there. I'm just going to set fire to them all. Do it. Burn, baby, burn. And watch. And then let my uh, uh, power suit recharge because I'm running low on that. <laughs> yeah, uh, I <clears throat> had a bit of a power thing too. Uh, we need to get some stuff out of this inventory. Uh, let's put some um, of you in there. Do you have any uh, cliff explosives? Uh, uh, not on me, because I put everything I have in a chest. So. Uh -huh. But there may be some in the chest up north. You have some grenades that I could use, but... To be honest, I can't really be bothered. Which is weird. I do enjoy blowing up trees, but right now I really just want the trees gone as fast as possible, and I think the fastest is to let the robots do it. Yeah. I mean, burning them is pretty good, but I mean, it thins out the trees, but it doesn't get rid of all of them. No. Unfortunately. Alright. Yeah, I'm running low on power as well now. Well, this is going to take a while, isn't it? Uh, 
Well, yeah, I mean, I mean, we don't have to clear all the trees out. We can just put down the blueprints and then clear the, the trees that are required. But then seeing stuff is a bit of a pain. But Yeah. I mean, we are 26 minutes into the episode. So we could call it early and then get rid of all the trees. Yeah. Off camera, because this is not exciting to watch. But that, that that's our, our plan, is to uh, do that and then, then clear the trees. We'll clear the trees. Yeah, kill the trees, kill the trees. Oh. Yeah, watch them, watch them burn or um, get chopped down by robots. Get chopped down by robots. Yeah, that's the plan. All right, so shall we do that? Yeah, sounds like a good plan. Yeah. All right. So thank you very much for watching, guys. We hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Have fun.